For this video, I'm going to be creating my own version of the Uncanny Valley makeup look which was trending like late last year at Tech So, because why not? <laughs> hey bro, what's up? For this look, we're going to block our eyebrows. I've got a tutorial video that shows you the steps and materials that you need in doing so. You can find the link for it in the descriptions. Okay, so I already blocked my eyebrows and then I put my foundation on and practically the base makeup on. And now I'm gonna do the contouring. So in Candy Valley makeup look, it's like more on the contouring. So we're gonna work on that. I don't know, my shadowing skills. What do you call it? <laughs> my skills with contouring is not that good. So, you know, we need to practice. <laughs> I'm gonna start contouring my forehead using the Morphe and James Charles palette. Okay, so I just used different shades of the neutral colors in the palette to play along with the depths and to have the effect that the that part is protruding like my eyebrows and yeah. I'm going for that really creepy looking character with bony facial features. I know we can do that using prosthetics, but I'm a broke ass bitch and I don't have them so here we are. <laughs> then I'm gonna go ahead and contour my temples, nose, cheekbones, and jawline. They would usually have weird looking sunken eyes, so we're gonna try to do just that. I'm using NYX Jumbo Pencil Shade Milk and apply them on my lash lines. I'm using the tattoo liner and black paint to make my pupils look elongated or larger without having to wear scleral lenses, if that makes sense. Okay, so it's actually tricky if you have hooded eyelids, especially like mine, I've got severely hooded eyelids and I've got this like sagging eyelid right here. So it's kind of difficult, that's why it's important for you to put eyeshadow primer before doing this or else it's gonna get really, really messy. I'm also applying white eyeshadow around the eyes to create an illusion of sunken eyes. I'm also gonna use brown eyeshadow below my eyes like tracing the bottom half of my eye sockets. Okay, so I did the other eye but I think I've done it like too far left but I think it's okay when I close them. Yeah, I think that they don't look that bad. <laughs> So now I'm gonna kind of draw a smile, you know, like the movie Smile, where people are just smiling so weirdly. So I'm gonna draw a smiling face right here, like this wide. And then after that, I'm gonna draw some shadows uh, on both sides of my nose to, you know, to have that like um, expression that I'm smiling. Now I'm using white paint to draw on my teeth. By the way, Boo, I also included a list of the products I used for this look in the description below. I don't know, I think it's going good. <laughs> okay, I think I just need to draw like gums to make it look more believable. <laughs> yeah. So I'm just gonna have to work on the details of the teeth and the gums. And then after that, I'm gonna work on the shadowing and shading and stuff like that around the mouth. Yeah, we're getting there, but we're getting there. Now I'm just using white eyeshadow again to emphasize and kind of highlight the high points of my face. I think that's it for the face right now. Maybe I'll remember something later on, but then I have to proceed on painting like a top, maybe a broken t-shirt or something, because I cannot. I cannot paint on my wound dressing. First, I'm gonna have to draw the outline and then I'm gonna color it in and we'll see how it goes. Did 
gets okay so i've decided to just wear a crop top <laughs> okay so right now i almost forgot to contour my neck so i'm just gonna do that and then highlight some edges as well and then we'll go to the details of the crop top <laughs> So I'm going to use blue paint to draw on the stitches and some details. So I also added a few red highlights on the crop top and then a few on my neck so that, you know, it's like kind of, it kind of brings the question where has it been, what has it been doing, yeah. <laughs> okay, boo, I think that's the look, I think we're all done. So yeah, I think that's it. Thank you very much for watching this video and I hope you like, subscribe, and share. And I'm gonna see you on the next one. Bye, Bo. <laughs>